tell you exactly the same thing as I am. Hello, Nicholas. How's the hand? Oh, I'm so excited for today's episode because this is a cool one. This is actually one of my, like, I think I always say this, but one of my favorite things for video and which is audio swells. You're like, oh, what are audio swells? I don't, I don't, I've never heard of one. You have definitely heard of one. You just don't know what it is. Or maybe you do know what it is and you just want to know how to do it. So you're just starting your day or did you just get off? So it's like this auditory ramp up where the, the volume just amplifies into the next scene. There are three different ways you can do like a ramp up. One of them is music, another one is like Foley, or the other one would be just like a sound effect ramping it into the next scene. There's one thing you haven't taken into account. And that's what the team is gonna make of this. See, you, now that you've heard it, you're like, yeah, okay, yeah, I've, I've totally heard that before. Now, this is most commonly used in like television specials in the most annoying way because they do it all the time. And once I tell this to you, you're just gonna be bothered by it. But it's like the crash symbol, put it in reverse, and then like, it's like, oh, something's going to happen next episode. See, now that you know it, you're like, oh, yeah, they, they do do that all the time. So stick with me and we shall go to the editing suite. Okay, so here's my scene. I basically have this scene playing out with just like some ambience and him walking up to her. Very simple, very easy going. So what we're going to do now to give it a bit more of that oomph, um, we're going to add our swells in. So here's the first swell that we're going to do, which is like this boom sound. I'll play it off to you. Pow! Okay, so what we want to do is drag and drop that into our scene. I'm going to pop it in right here. And if we play it, it's kind of weird because it's just a shot of Raven and then like a boom. It doesn't make any sense. So what we want to do is actually grab our boom and put it into reverse. This is going to give us that swelling sound. And now if we play it right now, we get something that looks like that. Now a lot more interesting. And the biggest key thing that you have to make sure is that your swell ends right when the shot cuts into the next bit. So if the swell, for instance, was a little bit earlier, this is what you would get. not as effective. So bring your swell right to the very ending of your shot. And then what you want to do next is your swell only holds effect if it has a hard cut of audio to work with or if it reverberates into the next scene. So what I've also downloaded here is the sound of a bike spike spinning around. So we're just going to take that and we're going to drag and drop it into this scene here. And it's going to play right when the scene starts. Pretty cool. And now if we play it back yet again, this is what we're going to get. A lot more interesting. And this is a very cool artistic flair that you can have as a transition in your movie. And it's done all the time. And if we want to add just a little bit more power, a little more pow to our scene here, we're going to add a swoosh in now. Bang, and here's the swooshes here. This is just like a download that I got off of freesound.org. I highly recommend you guys utilize that website. It's amazing, but remember to check out your Creative Commons licensing before downloading the sounds. Okay, so here's our sounds. You got that. That sounds pretty good to me. Now this one already has a ramp up, so we don't actually have to put it in reverse. So now we bring it in. Make sure that ramp up happens right here. And then we'll just kind of give it some lead way in. And if we play it, pretty great. And we're gonna do one final thing and that's with the sound design. That's the sound of like these trees here. If we single it out here, this is what we have. It would be very interesting is if we swelled the tree sound up. So I'm just gonna grab the pen tool here and just bring that right up, ramp it right up, right when all the other swells essentially start happening. And I'm gonna do it on the other track as well. So grab this, drag it right up, maybe make this a little bit lower. And then if we just play this on its own, we get this. Great, and then if we take that singling out, we'll just render this. Bop, bop, rendering, rendering, rendering. And boom, we have a swell action. Very cool. So then swells are endless. You can use them to cut yourself into other scenes like this. I'm a driver. 
it really is endless and is a really fun tool to get yourself in and out of scenes by using just an auditory cue. The moment you catch feelings. If you guys want to watch more swell action, I highly recommend you guys watch an Edgar Wright movie because he does it all the time. If you guys like this tutorial and take a look at my channel, there's way more tutorials on things and I hope to do more in the future. But you guys can always support me by giving me a subscribe, liking, and give me a comment of what a tutorial you would like to see. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys next week. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna swell myself out of here. Ready? And yeah!